Late this afternoon, the Douglas County prosecutor charged a 17 year old with first degree murder. It's a Fox 4 follow up to a weekend shooting in Lawrence. The family says left 14 year old Kamar J. Shaw dead. The suspect police say turned himself in Saturday. Fox 4's Tia Johnson in Lawrence with developments. Tia. Yeah, the district attorney's office says the suspect's first court appearance is here tomorrow. Now today, school resource officers were at the schools making sure they were there to support students. We um, build these relationships with these kids and unfortunately um, a tragedy happened to them and we want to be there for the family, we want to be there for the other kids, the friends, the staff, their staff that are upset today. The Lawrence community is mourning after 14 year old Kamar J. Shaw was shot to death. We know who he is. It certainly impacted all of us. I mean to lose a kid that once attended Lawrence Public Schools. Um, it's the hardest part about being a school resource officer, right? Monday, school resource officers were at schools to make sure students felt safe. The shooting happened Saturday. Shaw was shot near East 13th Street and Maple Lane. Police say he went to a nearby apartment complex for help, but later died. When something like this happens in the community, Lawrence is a very close-knit community, and all these kids know each other. Uh, it doesn't matter what high school they go to. Corporal Casey Wild says RJ wasn't currently a student in the district, but known by students and staff who are grieving his death. There are people out here that can help you. I have kids at my school that, that I see going down this path, and we had those conversations this morning. Fox Ford will be in the courtroom and will keep you updated as all of this develops. Tia Johnson, Fox 4, working for you.